like these weren't random bio pools. Like I just knew that meaty by bio pool. Like, watch, I'll call him out. I think I round star bio pool, didn't I? I'm not watching this intro. The fuck. Hello from Russia. Would you like to meet Arncros again at the tournament? Yeah, if I ever had to play him, I'm down to play him. I don't think Cetrion's the bio pool. What are you doing, walking back? Doing all that walking? Why are you doing all that walking back? I don't think the Come here. Talk, about talk to me real quick. Right here, yeah, and then right here, he wakes up buns. Once I saw that, I was like, okay, I know what I'm doing next time. I just wanted, I needed to mentally confirm that he was going to play like that. I didn't want to just bio pull media off the bat. I was like, look at him. Okay, that's what we're doing. Bet. Yeah, spending that KB. Oh, sorry, not even KB, that interactable right there. Just bio pool doesn't go that far, though. See, like, if I were to bio pool, like, right here, I couldn't, it wouldn't have reached. So, like, that's why I didn't do it from right here. Well, what went, what, have, what would have went through your head if he blocked it and punished it at the start? I would have just been like, okay, well, that's cool. Like, you're hitting me for 18%. It, the Kano just, the health leap doesn't matter when you're Kano. Like, the moment I, that shit works. Nah, see, Big D, like, that whole parry situation when I was playing, like, Liu Kang was different. Like, parry is, like, a big risk. Like, this is, this move is, like, the equivalent to flying kick if it launched, you know? So, I can't just stop using bio pool just because it got get blocked one time. He blocked it, like, multiple times, and it did not stop me from doing it. Like, I don't know if y'all recall, but Dragon blocked, like, multiple bio pools, but he also got hit by as many bio pools as he got. Uh, think about it. He yeah he he blocks a bio pool. I I eat maybe like if he's in the range, like eighteen percent twenty to restand. If I hit him, that's like twenty percent in a corner carry. Interactable right there just to catch on a little bit of damage. You know, not exactly. So yeah, I was just really paying attention to the way Dragon was moving in neutral. I was like, okay, he's doing a lot of back dash and forward dashing. He damn near ain't, he ain't blocking ever because he he's just so comfortable. So that's why I was so willing to do these bio pools. Getting the most damage. Look at that. You saw that? I flawless blocked the wall and then did EX and then I, not EX. I did bio pool punish. Reversal punish. Yo, what's good? VL, uh, VLJV. See? That's what I was talking about. He tried to wake up buns again. I, I was willing to show Dragon, I'm going to do the shit that people don't want to do to punish you from for doing that dumb shit. Even if it looks stupid on my end. Even if it's a risk for me, I'm, I'm punishing that shit. I don't give a fuck. Wake up buns? Alright. So now he ate what was that? Forty? Maybe forty five for for getting hit by two bio pools. And now he's in the corner. And I don't even need bar to be like dangerous with Kano in the corner. I just need four one two and acid. The Django, I only went over one match. I went over on Krabs before this. A lot of pressure right here. Over committing, but not going to get punished on that forward one too. Luckily for him, Dragon. Yeah. Unfortunate from Dragon, really not able to pick up the punish right there, but far from out. Of so right here, I was like, God damn it! I just had his ass in the corner. He missed that punish. I don't know. He probably thought I had a bar to ex, which I didn't. He he wasn't paying attention to my meter. Dragon was honestly probably kind of shook because he didn't have. I didn't have any meter. He could have killed me for that. He could have did two one three into fatal blow. I would have died. Now that was in recovery. I wonder if Dragon could have actually punished over there, but maybe not. Now Rewind has only a little bit of health to take away from Dragon, and that forward one two into the Kano Ball is gonna do it as he secures himself. I think Dragon was playing disrespectful for one because he probably he's never played my Kano, so he doesn't understand. Like I, I actually play Kano. This isn't just some like some garbage pick. He probably thought he was just gonna wax this and go to like grand finals or something. You know, he he didn't respect my Kano at all. I, I don't know if he didn't respect Kano at all or if he didn't respect my Kano at all. It was one or the other. And maybe he came off some salt too from losing Tekken Master, but hey, I came off salt from losing reverse throw to Sonic too. So, for one, getting away and using I mean, honestly getting a lot of mileage from the uh, from the pull. A little and part of me felt like he was disrespecting me because I was playing Kano. He's probably like, "This shit ain't Luke Kang." But we're also seeing some really intuitive punishes coming out. Good match. Has he ducked under a single four one two or not? Not every character, Cetrion can't duck yeah, the spit. She, she can't duck forward one too. Knocking, uh, the the but didn't Dragon say you were the one he was most nervous to face? Yeah, but probably my Liu Kang, not my Kano. Ridiculous. Cetrion pressure. 
Now right here, always that pushback being ever so bothersome. I don't know if he's talking about my Liu Kang. I don't know if he was talking about me as a player or just the me plus the characters I main. Like I actually could not believe he mashed right there to be honest. Why why can't why she can't duck on the fourth? Like ninety five percent of the cast can't duck that string. It's not you're not supposed to be able to duck that string. We have seen him just rip rounds out people's hands by just pushing them in the corner. But Plus, Citron has like a male hitbox anyway. Like, she can't even duck like Johnny's high fireballs. Now we go into the final round. And to think that the two of the three American. Yeah, social, but that's like a weird conversion that you. That comes up very rarely to hit down one at command grab. It's not like easy. It has to like hit a certain way. It might even have to anti air. Is going to be just enforcing as much of the uh, the cane of pressure as he can, really. Yo, appreciate that, Maze. Yeah, no, we've definitely seen it work in the first round, but Dragon has broken oh up there. God. Ooh, so, Three, I was so first. tight mentally when I got stand for input error trying to do 2 4, and he would have got open. Because I wasn't even trying to do, he was looking for something that I wasn't about to do. I did. I, I was like, I was plus one. I was like, all right, I'm gonna do two four acid, and then he down four KBs me. Like, I didn't even mean to do that shit. Yo, what up, Subtaco? See, you see, Dragon was getting too confident in neutral. Like he was dashing in after tornado. I'm like, I will do this bio pool, buddy. I will do it. Sorry, the, the down one check off that plus two. I actually am a maniac. Okay, this is this is some maniac shit. Like, just, uh, got a little he has two one three KB locked and loaded. I have only forty seven percent health, and I did reversal down. cannonball ball, only because I wanted the knockdown if it hit. I wanted to chase him back dashing. Bio pull wouldn't have reached, and I had no bar to ex bio pull anyway. But this yeah, shit hit. Boom! I was like, oh. Plus two in the corner. Again. I low key was like, why'd I do that? But it worked. Right here from just definitely playing very, very aggressively. I literally would have lost if he just blocked that. that maybe just, uh, got pressed a little bit too Sorry that I keep down. replaying this, but Sorry, look, 42% health. If he blocked that, 2 1 3 KB, I'm dead. Big call outs right here from Rewind. He's definitely playing very, very aggressively. Not afraid to make a few risky decisions. Yeah, Rewind definitely. My goodness me, I was about to say, making a lot of risks. See, like, I basically died. I, I, I died. I could have died for doing bio pools. Like, he looked at 37 because he blocked the bio pool, and guess what? I just did it again. I could tell Dragon was anxious to try to get the chip. He was trying to chip me out. And I was like, he's, he, was, he was trying to, like, whip normals and neutral to probably... Very, very bait me so that he could just chip me out you know, right here i was just playing a mental game i was just walking him down because i was like let me let me try to play some some mind games real quick top kano is not top seven right now we got to see if this is going to rattle the cage of someone like dragon you know who is composed as you can see the bpms on their heart rate every time dragon beat me though it was like a wash like some some games i was like i was just not blocking like right here did like five down ones I feel like it's only right if Rewind plays Kano like an utter scumbag right now, but it is paying off having one point on the board. Okay, great weapon punish right there. 41 3 from Dragon. He's going to be applying pressure using that wall as well to potentially blow up any flawless. Yo, thank you guys for the follows. I'm getting so many followers. Holy shit. As well, back into the Deadly Winds. Now, that is a very, very oppressive string right there. That 1 1 very generous. It's crazy. Like, after Dragon lost the first game, he was still playing the same way he was when he lost. So, that was what was confusing me. I was trying so hard to flawless block that tornado, but I just couldn't do it. I don't know why. Extremely well and isn't biting. Yeah, the rewind has a big comeback oh over here that he has to make. Okay, Dragon didn't want to break over there, probably anticipating the armor break. Rewind getting himself a little more damage on the table. Dragon almost could have lost all because he did not want to block right there. Good read on that down one. Flawless blocking off of plus frames and stuff is honestly like um, it's it's not as difficult as it might look. But that situation, you know, in this kind of a high stakes environment, you've got to make a, a hell of a call out in order to do that. But the armor breaking rewind. Talking about call outs. So down one, another down one. Has the corner I could tell Dragon down. actually OS's the pressure because I did two down ones right here because I was trying to see how he defends versus it. And he knows the OS. Like, he, he knows how to block acid and duck the command grab. Down one, another down one. Has the corner to work with at the moment. So I was actually kind of happy that I recognized that early. 
going to have to really get out the corner, though, because if Rewind starts to build momentum and has Dragon in the corner, we all saw what happened earlier when you have that flame carpet out, and it can just be a really, really bad situation to be in when you're taking down and burning. Gets the fur right now, and I got hit by wall because I was trying to flaw his block. I did that cane bolt so I could stop him from trying to just do random ass boulders. It's definitely a great answer on that boulder toss, not letting Dragon get away with that in the slightest. Now, DZ, I do not think that that's worth it. Just a little bit too antsy right there. He's going to have to break, not able to because of the deadly... Throwing game. knife and amping bio pool after is kind of ass. Can you explain the West? You're basically just letting go of block just enough frames to, to duck a man grab, but blocking, right again, uh, blocking again fast enough so that you block acid. getting hit by a lot of things, but you wouldn't... No one see him get hit by. Yeah, so you basically yeah, avoid the Kabag grip and block the acid off every tick throw. Well 500 no host. No, I had like 200 and then Foxy hit me with those. Hit me like the 250 raid. Buttons right there and rewind. Now has Dragon almost at 50% life right here, but has him in the corner. Oh, this is not where you want to be. Except the flame carpet. Go for command grab. 18%. Okay. This was a really bad round. That round was actually mop. I had a feeling he was going to roll right there. I was like, I need this corner. He, he Dragon always tries to roll out the corner just so that he can at least start the round out the corner. That's like most people, though. Look at that. Like half life already. And he rolled again. I literally couldn't believe it. Dragon right now just trying to use that wall get anything going for him gets pushed back towards the corner in this plus two i like rewind's adaptation right there to use four to one knowing that dragon's gonna start i can't believe i had this much of health lead and almost lost this game too dragon was getting so aggressive like no health as we have seen as we can't rewind out just slam you right back in the lumbar check with six percent on the board Got my shit with punished. I was like, fuck. Saw that happening and did not let it uh, work for Rewind in the slightest. He's going to get that corner reposition. Dragon does have that fatal blow. If he's able to find himself a solid hit right now, that will kill if he's able to confirm it. Rewind, on the other hand, all he needs is one command grab or one good mid and a confirm. Dragon slowly whittling down this health bar and Ooh, catches him to rising wall. Great read from Dragon pushing back against Rewind. That was definitely. Where did the name Rewind come from? I just used to play COD. I thought it was a like, cool looking COD name. It is very, as, honestly, this is as even as it can get right now. It really is. It's, it's very I thought people pick acid to cover the gaps in the candle strings. Yeah, that's orig That's what its original use, one of its original use was for. But then we figured out that there's an OS. Yeah, now that was a really tough drop for him as well. Was this offline? Yeah, this is offline. Very oppressively, just holding Dragon down, but Dragon with the flawless block reversal. Denying Rewind's pressure, forcing him back into the neutral. Tries to get a punish on the bio pull, but not going to work out for him. This was kind of scary because I had like, oh, now I have the health lead, but I have to constantly take a billions of percent of chip just to finally get to Cetron. And then she could just teleport out. He didn't want to block. And then he just won one when I even got close. A lot of raw damage right now, and that was a very important decision. I do like the idea because you're going to start to even out the health bars over here. Now it's going to put it into a situation where now Rewind was probably going to have to guess, and he's going to have to be a lot more careful about his uh his uh, approach offensively. Absolutely, you don't want to overextend against Dragon right now. You're in death territory. Oh but the my goodness. goodness! I was so clutch. So right here, I was like trying not to get hit by beams, but I was also trying to get in. At that same time, I was trying to watch out for wall. So right here, I was like, mm, kind of can't block anything else. So, but this, then I was just like, fuck it, come here. Yank. Robbed again. He said everyone in the playroom was howling. <laughs> now that right there was just i wish they had like a player room player lounge cam where you could see everybody's reactions to shit to do? dragon got really empty and spent all that bar trying to chip out rewind but it wasn't enough and when he was right, i ain't gonna lie right here chat right here I, I i think i talked about yesterday i was trying not to laugh i, I was trying so hard not to laugh because i feel like you could see it on my face it looks like even rewind himself was surprised but he actually landed that <laughs> Very, very Yo, good. a foxy motherfucking grandpa with a six butch. Appreciate you, boss man. My boy, a foxy motherfucking boss man. 
That's that boy Foxy, boy. Point advantage as we are two one over here. Yo, thank you so much, Big Foxy, for the goddamn resub. And don't forget the raid. Hit me with the fat raid. Is this the set that eliminated Dragon? Yes, sir. Wait, what? Was there two subs or am I tripping? Oh, uh, yo. What, how do you say your name? Mike? Mikey? M1K. I'm gonna say M1K. Thank you so much for the tier one. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I am so grateful. Not for real though. Like, I'm actually like super grateful, bro, because y'all don't know how much it means to have you guys support. I ain't gonna lie. I was feeling a little too cocky this game. I, I was feeling too up. I was doing bio pools like after everything right here. I bet everybody thought I was gonna lose in the players' lounge after that that damn round. Nice Kano, hoping you're gonna play it more. I would have played it more, but Sonic uh Sonic plays Joker and Joker smacks Kano like terrible. Smacks him silly. I kept trying to flaws block this shit, so I just kept getting hit. Look at how dumb she is. Oh my god. Okay, Joker duck the spit. Joker can duck the spit. He can punish the acid. Full combo. It's it's bad. I suppose with the biomagnetic pull, you know, using it a lot, and it just hasn't really been working out because Dragon's just been patient, and now Dragon knows that you know what I've been I've been blown up by this move quite a lot, and is generally just make has been making the adaptation since the beginning of the set really, but now would Jackie work against Kano too? Yeah, yeah, Jackie ducks the spit too. To that specific move after the way that Dragon lost that third game. Why didn't why do you you didn't play Lou versus Sonic? Because I don't like that matchup. I do not like Lou versus uh, Joker. So I, I made a big call out, and I feel like that down 2KB was a big reason why I won that, that first round. He tried to get he tried to hit, hit me with one of the most up grabs I've ever seen. Duck that motherfucker. Duck a Wested, actually. It's good. Thursday. Yo, Crazy Chef, appreciate the, the two months, bro. Thank you so much for the goddamn two months. Shout out, Crazy Chef. What's good? Yeah, as everyone checks in with the down one over there, the crossover, flaws block up two, not working out because... How does Lou do versus Joker? I don't like the matchup. He does okay. I mean, it's like 5-5, five, five maybe. I don't know, though, because that shit was already annoying before Joker started hitting people for 30% every touch. Looking really, really strong in this set as well. Four two, he's got, so he's going to keep the plus frames in the corner. Using these down yeah, but yeah, essentially Lou's reach is very bad versus Joker. Wait, what? Yo, Bilal, thank you so much for the Twitch Prime, bro. The two months. I appreciate you, bro. Oh, my God. You guys are going dumb in the chat. Hold up. Oh, my God. Yo, J Dub, thank you for the the prime, bro. Good lord. Really crazy. Just reads on the biomagnetic pool and spin like cinching him so much damage. Can we just talk about the um, range on that forward? But Joker can duck Johnny Street Force Balls. His pressure's not that good. Yeah, Joker can. Joker does good versus like all my mans. Yo, rewind. Why no pissed off versus Sonic? I use camera because I get guaranteed damage because he can't break. And I can I have the ability to side switch. Like I could cross him over and put him back in the corner if I get a hit. It's the only way that like I could actually get out of the corner. I had the feeling it would come down to the very, very last round between these two. But we will ultimately take the victory and proceed through. I don't like I don't like um Joker versus Lube because Sonic never does jack in the box in positions where I can actually fly and kick it and Sonic just flawless blocks all of Lou's fireballs anyway, so I actually really deal no chip from zoning versus him. He just flaws blocks all my projectiles and he gets in. So until people play that matchup offline, like they really don't know the matchup. Like imagine every time you throw a projectile, somebody they flaws block it and they dash in once and they're like already in your face. 
No. Once again, yeah, Dragon, no defensive bar right now. If he's I don't want to play sub versus Sonic because you can tell he's fishing with that one one trying to catch. He uh, he would just switch to Jade and counter pick me. Sonic has like counter picks for all the matchups that he could possibly lose to. My boy Dragon, sorry, you guys are just distracting me from analyzing this shit. Hold up. So, uh, essentially, right here, hit him with knife. I didn't realize this until that happened, but I didn't know if you hit people with EX and knives. When you do bio pool, the knives fly out of them, and you actually get like unscaled damage. Like as you can see, that look, the knives fly out. You see them right, right here. They flew out, and I got 38% for this, this confirm, all because dragon meshed. Like I'll put it in slow mode just so you guys can see. Trying to play with that space a little bit, push back as well on the amplified hell's wrath as he knocks back. Hit him with the knives, and then when I pulled him, I pulled the knives out of him, and then that shit did 38%. Doesn't Ninja win against Sonic with Lou? I mean, he didn't win Final Combat, did he? And that was when Joker wasn't as good as he is now. Joker was still top three, but he was... Liu Kang was better then, and Joker is better now. So, Sonic won Final Combat over Ninja when Joker was less broke than he is now. Is Joker top five? Joker's top two. What the fuck are you talking about? But yeah, that was me versus Dragon. Yeah, honestly, Dragon's a legend. You know, top probably top three NRS player of all time, so he'll hook. He'll bounce back from this. Uh, I was actually surprised to see that the set bothered him that much after. Uh, but, you know, I had to do what I had to do. I needed the bag. I was trying to win the tournament. I'm not about to just let you run through me, you know. But, yeah, it was a good set.